this Uvalde strong sign popped up along Main Street just days after the tragedy. And the man behind it didn't stop there. Uh, after work, my full-time job, come straight over here to back to my house and we'll start working on them. I've been working since the Memorial Day until right now. <laughs> For the past week, his hobby has taken on a different meaning. I know Miss Ellie Stevens' daughter. Her, her uncle works for me in Uvalde Supply, right? That's uh, Ruben Mata's granddaughter. It's taken on a different purpose. I just do it out of my heart because I mean, they're kids. You lose it just by saying that, don't you? It's okay. We all do, man. 21 crosses, each with a set of bright white wings, but not one the same. Different colors, different letters. One even has a puppy that just made sense. Like a dinosaurs and ninjas, but he loved, he, he loved his dog more. So I, I put him a little dog there. Well, they wanted a little dog. For Richard, this is what he could do to help, to comfort, to stop his own tears from rolling down his cheeks and maybe do the same for families, if even for a moment. I hope they like it, and I mean, that's all I can, you know, give. The crosses have started to be delivered, but Richard's grandson angels. thought there was one more thing to be done. But now he wants angels to put over there where I had that uh, Wally Strong sign in Main Street. 21 crosses, 21 angels, and one man with a heart of gold. Richard Rubio, just another example of why this place is Uvalde Strong.